We want to work towards helping more people by changing the way that we do things for the benefit of all. Collaboration is the key to success. Angelique, she got a scoliosis. The curve was so important, they compressed the heart and the pulmon. I don't know how lungs. you say that. The what? The lungs. Lungs. After time, we think, and no, it's not normal to go at this place. It's not at me. I do. Uh, I have to call that specialist to take an appointment. I have to call another one for another appointment. It's with uh, the program MUSCO. Uh, everything's going to be uh, fixed at one and it's going to be more simple for all the parents and the patient. Uh. I think that this will help a lot in terms of that idea of just like avoiding that broken telephone line, you know? So like one doctor says this and then, so you're going to from one visit to another visit and you're pretty much as a patient, a parent, are either showing up with a piece of paper or transmitting the information that you went to with that, being like, oh, Dr. A said this, so we need to do this but the way that I might have received that information might be completely different than what Dr. A actually meant. Do you know what I mean? So I think that this will definitely help make the information a lot clearer. Um, it will make the transition between hospital A and hospital B more efficient, uh, less wait time, um, and also I'd say probably less bureaucracy. You know, uh, the fact that you need a referral to go to hospital one and then a, refer a referral to go to hospital two and all this type of stuff, well that information's already gonna be like transmitted, everything's gonna be a lot quicker and you're not waiting for that phone call for that appointment. You can show up at that hospital and they'll already have all your information on file. Prior to this initiative, it was very difficult for patients from to go from one center to the other or when they did or they had to, then they were uh, confronted with some administrative hurdles. Right now, these patients are usually seen maybe in one center and then treated in another one for their surgery and then seen for the post-op somewhere else. The idea is to really have these patients be taken care of as a consortium or something that as a group. So the, 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 the approach is going to be more in terms of focusing on their pathology or their condition than on the actual where they are, where they treated, for example.